And da -da -da -da, I'm Tony Beer Whisper, and as promised, part two to the uh, <laughs> Oak Age Troublemaker. Uh, you know what? I gotta tell you something. Uh, when I first poured it, I, had, I had, didn't have it real cold. Excuse me. Uh, but I didn't have a chill on it. Uh, and uh, the first sip, like I, I had mentioned, it, I got some sweetness, and then I got some pine. Uh, but now as I've let it sit a, a little bit, this is on my first glass here, uh, I am getting uh, bigger oak notes on the nose, a huge, huge amount, some sweet caramel going on. Uh, more piney than citrus. I'm not getting the citrus that you do uh, in most cases from, from this type of beer. But now that I've 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 drank some and let it sit and, and warm just a tad, uh, I am getting bigger oak notes. I wasn't getting huge oak notes earlier, which kind of goes to the point that I was trying to make in the first video is that you know when you when you go to a brewery and you get a sample, they give you what a, you know an ounce, two ounces, whatever. Uh, so it's hard to get you know you, you, can, you can get an idea what that beer is going to taste like. But some cases, well, when you're talking about a beer like this, you know, with the Pilsner, like Pilsner, you, you can pretty well sum it up in two ounces. But in a complex beer like this one here, uh, you know, well, in, well, any any IPA, any uh, any stout, uh, uh, any imperial stout, anything with a lot of character, it's really going to take more than two ounces to sum it up. Um, you can decide in that two ounce if you want a full glass or not, but to be honest and to be fair, if you really want to judge that beer accuracy, uh, accuracy, <laughs> accurately, I'm having trouble speaking already. <laughs> this is my first one. Ta-da! Uh, anyway, to, to judge it accurately, you really need at least a full pint. And in some cases, as Stuart and I found out with some of those other beers, um, uh, Sam Adams 13th Hour, for instance, uh, you know, we're not even sure we could sum it up in, in that bottle. Uh, you know, sometimes it takes a little bit. Uh, you've got to really sit and examine it. And you, I think you could decide if you like it or not before then, but you can't. Sometimes it takes at least a pint, sometimes two, to really accurately understand all the flavors and nuances in the beer. Um which is why I, I I bought a growler rather than buying a pint because this is one I really want to sit and dissect because the Imperial IPA uh, is one of my favorite styles and the Oaked version is even a bigger favorite for me at the moment. It used to be that I was all about the stout, you know, I love the stout, love the Imperial, and I still do. Uh, I love 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 especially bourbon barrel. Imperial Stouts, but uh, right now I, I'd have to say I'm really into the, the, the double Imperial IPA and and even more so uh, anything barrel aged. <laughs> you know, I don't know if anybody's tried to do a bourbon barrel aged <laughs> double IPA because that's something I'd be interested in. <laughs> but but I love oak aged. Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> you know what I mean? Take a 10% take a double IPA already. Age in some bourbon barrels and see what the hell happens. Holy Smoky mother of pearl, she's gonna blow. But anyway, I digress. Uh, <laughs> <whoo. laughs> this is a bit. Of, what was I saying? What we're we talking about? Anyway, uh, oh, there's my cat. Sir. Shadow's over here, and Lars just made an appearance because she likes to be on camera. Somehow she senses when I'm doing a video and likes to be seen. Oh, uh, so I, I I said I was going to do several of this, and I'm going to because this is just wonderful. As I'm finishing my first first pint here, uh, man, I do love this glass he bought he brought me. Uh, wow, I, I love that. You know, uh, a lot of American bars you go and you they sell you a pint, but they don't give you an actual pint. They serve it in a, a glass that only holds 16 ounces. So by the time you, you're actual, probably only getting about 12 ounces of it. Frustrates to piss out of me. But I love this action. I love to be able to pour a full pint at home. Oh, just oh, oh, it gives me real wood. I tell you that right now. Hey, this is a great beer. Mothers, mothers, mothers. Oak aged. <laughs> <laughs> Oak Age Troublemaker. Holy cow.